an octagon key. <laughs> this is just... I think they're just going to go through all the shapes in existence. All the shapes known to geometry. Um, and then... Uh-oh. You're too late. <laughs> I already called the cops. You're already as good as dead. Yeah, well, I still get to murder you. Did you take that into account? Give me an octagon key. Oh, yeah. You know, at least she died happy, thinking she had the last laugh. So, what did you see? Is this still a part? This is still part of the game. A man with eyes in strange places. Yeah, that one too. Me in a house murdering people. Or nothing. I wonder what happens if you say nothing. I want to say... I mean, I'll be, I'll be as honest as I can. Oh my, quite the character I see. But no worries, I'm not gonna judge you. After all, I already knew. If I may, you're looking a tad bit tired. How about we just close our Just for a bit, you know. Why does he want us to close our eyes, I wonder? Save point! Alright, now, are we still in the Judith Manor? Or are we in some other completely random place? Did we come back through the octagon 
door. Is this a new area? I think so. Wait, what? The door is locked. The lock is in the shape of a balbus. I don't even know what that is. Is that a shape? It sounds like some kind of instrument. Is that a, what, what? What is that? Oh, it's another one of these labyrinthian hallways. Oh, we'll figure it out. Oh my god, that scared the hell out of me. What? Is this guy attached to us? I don't even know. Oh my god, that scared me. Oh, another note from Simon. Oh, little marshmallow. I knew we had so much in common. I just knew it. You're just full of surprises, aren't you? I dreamt about you. I dreamt that you and I were in one of those gurneys. Ooh. We were strapped together and tied in tight. No one was going to take us apart. I slowly slid my hand under your robes, undressed you. Okay, you were so soft. Marshmallows are soft. It adds up. Kind of weird to tell somebody you don't know that in a letter, however. Oh, the things I want to do to you, little marshmallow. Would you moan? Would you squeal? Would you whimper? I'd like it if you screamed. I would imagine you give the most wondrous scream. Would you scream for me? Would you scream real good? Simon is yours and you are mine, little marshmallow. Okie dokie. Now we're trapped in a small red room. What? I guess this is, is this what he meant? <laughs> I'm in this room and I'm- Oh my. What, what do I, what, I, I actually can't do anything. Do I just wait? Oh my, this is quite a pickle, isn't it? How so ever will you get out? I don't know, I'm waiting for you to tell me. Uh, have you checked that wall over there? What wall? They're all the same. <laughs> of course you have. You know, I can probably help you out here. If you're just willing to close your eyes. Come on, let them out. Just close them. Have you ever closed your eyes and seen colors form on the back of your eyelids? Where you lay your head to the rest and there's a sound coming from where there should be none? Why can't one dream with their eyes awake? Why is the darkness of the world so much more terrifying than the darkness beyond your eyes? It's the unseen. Close your eyes. I don't know. Something's there through the bars. Peer through? Peer through. Do you know where you're going? There are a lot of nooses in this room. I know exactly where I'm going, thanks. No, I'm clueless. I'll just keep going wherever this pack takes me. Oh no, don't do that. That sounds terrible. If we say I'm done, does that end the game? 
I'm going to say I'm clueless. I want to know what he says. Really? You have no idea? You know, there's been something I've been meaning to ask you. The subway system, if we can still call it that, wasn't anywhere close to where you were supposed to be executed. So why'd you come here? What drew you here? You don't need to answer that. After all, I already know the answer. So far, you've been an amazing contestant. But the stakes are rising, and the challenge is only going to get tougher as we move on to round two. That was all round one. You sensed it, haven't you? Things aren't going to get any better. There's no way you're going to escape death, you know. At least in any meaningful way. You're a wanted man. You've done terrible, terrible things that can never be forgiven. You were used, disposed, tarnished. Who really cared for you? Did anyone ever really help? And in the end, here you are. Utterly, truly alone. Besides me, of course. Let me give you a piece of advice. Ghosts are real. Is that advice? They haunt every one of us until the day we die. Oh, I get what he means. It's a metaphor. We just try to forget that they're even there. Painting ignorance has always been one of humanity's most unique, beautiful, twisted. Forget your role in this. Now hurry. I hear there's some people that are just dying to meet you. <laughs> Saying the bell is key. Good, we can go this way now. God, you know, I don't even remember where we are anymore. What if we went this way? How about... Lem... Lemnus gate? I don't... I don't know. I've never even heard of these shapes. Oh, they're all redone. Okay, Enneagram. There wasn't a door here before. Oh, that's right, there wasn't. There was only one on the left. It's locked and there's no keyhole. You fail as a door. I don't see any sort of keyhole. I don't see any sort of keyhole. So I have to say, at this point in the game, I can honestly say, this game is not anything like I thought it would be. Like the, um, morality provoking questions, the disturbing, oh, I got the right key, the disturbing concepts, what they make you think about and make you do. Is that chasing us? This hallway is suddenly never ending. Oh my goodness. That was scary. What was that? I'll say. Ugh, where are we? This is like a maze.
We're not gonna kill more people, are we? I don't want to do that. <laughs> Oh my god. There's one of those things over there. Oh. Oh, I don't know where we're going. There's a thing in here that wants to kill us. I'm guessing if that thing catches- I don't even know what that thing is, but I'm guessing if it catches up with us, it's just like instant kill. And we get game over, and we have to start over again. Did I find the way out? please. Oh no! Okay, I think I'm gonna stop for now. If you would like to play Close Your Eyes for yourself, um, I will put a link in the description for you as well as a link to Yai's website if you want to check out other games they have. They do have a few other games that are very similar to this one, which I will hopefully play eventually. And for now, thanks for watching, thanks for being my player too, until next time, don't get scared without me.